Welcome to a tutorial for exporting DICOM in Treatment Studio Viewer to CD. After a patient scan has been opened by Treatment Studio, insert a blank CDR into your computer's DVD CD burner. An autoplay pop-up window will appear where you will click on the X to close. Select File on the menu bar and choose either Export DICOM in Viewer to CD or Export DICOM only to CD. Accept Full in the pop-up window and select Save. The case will now be sent to your computer's burn directory. Upon completion, select OK in the Treatment Studio pop-up window. You will then be directed to the burn directory. Click OK. Next, select the file to be copied to the CD by left mouse clicking and selecting Burn. The Burn a Disk pop-up window will appear. Check or accept the defaults and select Next. The DVD RW Drive pop-up window will appear next. Select Burn to Disk. The Burn to Disk pop-up window will appear. Make changes or accept the defaults by clicking Next. The case and the Treatment Studio Viewer, unless you choose DICOM only, will be written to the CDR. The burner's tray will open upon completion. When the completed CDR is inserted into a player, the autoplay pop-up window will appear. Select Open Folder to view files using Windows Explorer. Next, double mouse click on the saved file or right mouse click on the file and select Run as Administrator, which may open the case faster. The speed with which a case opens is dependent on the computer and its hardware. If opening a case as Administrator, the user account control pop-up window will appear asking do you want to allow the following program from an unknown publisher to make changes to this computer select yes your computer is now preparing the scan to be opened in the included treatment studio viewer software once a case opens in treatment studio viewer you'll be given three option tabs the first the section tab will give you the opportunity to see 2D slices or you can see 3D volumetric sets. You also have the Art Section tab and you have the Gallery tab that will hold any images that you save for viewing. Thank you for being part of our tutorial today.